Okay, so can you hear me? Praise God. So please raise those donations for CVCA. Children, look everywhere for those donations. Christian education builds character. In fact, yeah, so... Good morning. It's so good to see all of you. Happy Sabbath. All these smiling faces. Okay, you're going to... Thank you so much. So I have something to show you. These are seeds. What do you notice about them? Danica, yeah? They, yes, exactly. Okay, Danica, Lizzie, Rhea? From far away, they look something like red. Oh, okay. Okay, Violet? Okay. You know what these are? These are seeds. And these seeds get to be so big, they can even grow into a tree. These little tiny seeds. In fact, these seeds grow a plant all over the Bay Area. And one seed can produce many, 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 many plants, just from this one seed. And it's yummy, too. It grows into plants that are rich in vitamins and minerals. And because of the program today, I really wanted to tell you about those vitamins and minerals, but I'm going to refrain. I, okay, that's a thought. Lizzie said apple tree. So, okay, well, maybe you're close, Lizzie. Well, I'll tell you, Chinese people make these into a delicious dish. And so do Asian Indians and many Americans, too. Does anybody know what this incredible tiny little seed is? Yes. It's a mustard seed. Look at that, Annie. 
Christians often use mustard seeds as a symbol of faith because it's something Jesus said in the Bible. In Luke 17, 5 through 10, when Jesus' friends asked him how they could have stronger faith or believe more, Jesus said, if you had faith even as a teeny little mustard seed, you could say to the mulberry tree, be uprooted and planted in the sea, and it would obey. Why did Jesus say such a funny thing? Jesus was really smart. He intentionally chose such a difficult illustration so that it would get people's attention and make them think. He really did not intend for the disciples to do magic. Did you know that? Because magic glorifies the magician, not God. What Jesus was saying is that God is so powerful that if our faith is even as small as a little seed, then we can do incredible things with his power. God can do incredible things if we believe, even if we believe a little bit. Jesus didn't say someone with the faith of the mustard seed can move trees to the sea so that a bunch of people could start moving trees to the sea. No, that wasn't his point. His point was he was teaching us that it doesn't take great faith to do great things. Why? Because what happens doesn't depend on us. It depends on God. God has the power to do anything. And God is for us, and so we can trust him. And if God is for us, who can be against us? So that mustard seed faith, that's mustard seed faith. So next time you hear that, you'll know why. We should ask God, we should all ask God for mustard seed faith so we can believe and never doubt his incredibly mighty power. You can go back to your sleep. If you want a mustard seed, I can give you one later and also tell you all the nutritional value. Can't wait to tell you that. <laughs>